Okay, sound is working. On the left side of your screen, we have Mono Black. That would be Cat Party. And on the right, we have Force of Phil with Miracles, as usual. Mystic Sanctuary tap to start the game for Force of Phil. Dark Ritual. Okay. Three floating. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Ashiok, oh my god. All right, we're off to a great start. Here's Ashiok, folks. Ashiok Dream Render? Is that what this card is called? All right, it's getting forced pitching counterbalance. Um, okay. uh, That's a nasty one. All right, Force of Phil fights off the turn one. Ashiok and now has cast a brainstorm past the turn. BCS, thank you for the raid. Welcome, everybody. We're just getting started. Tabletop Legacy. <laughs> Dear God. All right, Force of Phil. Force of Phil getting bombarded already with. Uh, all, all the tricks that we can come up with. Chains of Mephistopheles here and a uh, cycling Lorian revealed in response. Yeah, we're starting off strong as, is, is how I would put it. Poor force of Phil, oh my god. <laughs> so if I remember how to do a little bit by uh, anytime I would draw outside of my draw, my first draw. Yeah, Pew Pew putting it perfectly. The NYC meta needs to calm down. Neon, thank you for the sub with Prime. Six months and I love this channel, says Neon. Thank you, Neon. I love this channel too. <laughs> Thank you, Neon. Appreciate that. Yeah, right. uh, I love my own channel. Uh, I'll pass you. I'll take that. I'm just kidding. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're good. Gift leader Audrey says, WTF is wrong with our mono black players main decking chains of Mephistopheles. Yeah, the... Uh, it's getting wild. Here's Dothy Voidwalker. Wasteland fired off. Swords on Void Walker in response. Two, and three, and this is dead. Jen says, Jen said, if I paid 4K for a set of chains of Mephistopheles, I would look for any opportunity to play them. I think that makes sense. Yeah. Here's counterbalance. That's something. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh. All right, Liliana the Veil. Lorian revealed on top. Revealed. And Liliana activated. What did what did Cat Party discard just now? Did anybody see what that was? You got it. Oh, go for the throat. Thank you. Yeah, I think you're right. Yep. So 15 all. Pew Pew says, off camera, Chris said 90s MTG is a golden prison. <laughs> he can't quit because he's addicted to the celebrity lifestyle. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. Dear God. Uh, you got to Yep. Go to 11. Yeah, sorry. Crinky Doom asking the right questions. Was Chains even tested for 1v1? You know the answer, Crinky. Absolutely not. It's a commander card. So Force of Phil, Hellbent, Liliana, the Veil on the table, plus a Chains of Mephistopheles. It, it's not looking good for Force of Phil at the moment. You can dig out of this, though. Uh, Liliana, the Veil will eventually ultimate, which is scary. Or do I mill? No. Yes. Um, um, 12, the uh, for you. Um, if there are no cards on player's hand, take Pass the top card from the library and place it in the graveyard. Yeah. Okay. Okay, a ponder happening here, and this will lead to a mill instead of a draw, I guess, because Phil doesn't have any cards in hand, right? I think Phil is hellbent now. 
Right. Okay, pawn or shuffle. It just depends. I, I believe Phil has no cards in hand. Let's see how this goes. Yep, a mill. All right, so Phil is hellbent, confirmed. Uh, Lily Last Hope? <laughs> Liliana the Last Hope. Oh my god. Ooh, what is that? Eat it. Give it to me. Oh, what is that? Oh. My yeah, go for it. Yep. Oh man, I forget what this card is called. It's some some card. Uh, uh, yeah. And it costs three. Just count Um, I. This went up once. You haven't used it yet, Mister. Yep. All right, both players hell bent. Liana the Veil is up to six loyalty, and Phil is going to cast this card. Witness the future. Thank you, Audrey. Uh, oh, it's a voice. Sorry, I keep going. I'm going to eight, right? Uh, eight I'm at eight. You're at nine. Yeah. Oh, uh, enemy dead. My troll. Yeah. Uh, and then Astro. All right. Yeah. Pick a dinosaur. Yep. Uh, Resolving this witness to future here. Impulse. Now an impulse. Random order. Any overview? It's just that. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna play Mystic Sanctuary. Put this back. Go oh, sure. Mystic Sanctuary putting witness to future back on top. So counterbalance has a three on top once again. <laughs> Close. <All right. laughs> a bit of a wacky race. Okay, yeah. Oakish Bowmaster off the top. That's uh, that's interesting. Check this up. Yeah, we we did we found a vaccine for Pox, so don't worry about it. Lively, thank you for the sub with Prime. Appreciate that. Uh, All right, Phil will draw and probably cast this witness to future again. There it is. Liliano the Veil has seven loyalty right now. Uh, I'm gonna cast it with no targets. Okay. So casting it, no targets, shuffling nothing back into the library. Uh, did something go wrong? That's oh, okay. I target zero cards and then shuffle them in, I guess. It says up to. It says up to. Okay. Yeah, so I guess. So I should. I, I don't know. <laughs> Either way, I know it was on top, so. Yeah, well, I knew it was on bottom, is why. So like, I'm thinking That's that I, I should put yeah. something back in. That way, it's actually a reasonable thing that I'm doing. You know what I mean? Yeah, I'm just because otherwise I wouldn't I wouldn't shuffle. Uh, so I'll, I'll just okay. put this back in. That way yeah. it's not. Okay, they fixed it. They uh, realized that Phil wasn't supposed to shuffle. I guess if he didn't choose a card, but uh, they weren't sure. They just whatever. Audrey says you still shuffle according to the rules. Okay. Are we going to see the ultimate, uh, the Liliana ultimate, possibly? So now Phil is uh, impulsing here. Got my little espresso cup again. People like this. Popular cup. Random. Uh, I will pass this round. Combat? Yep. for two. All right, getting the offense up and running. Bowmaster and Nork Army attack for two. Gamorian Guard token. We we allow Star Wars CCG by decipher tokens on 90s MTG. That's just our policy. Uh, yeah. 
Especially cards from the Jabba's Palace set. Um, These legacy players don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, So Liliana's at eight loyalty now. Text just popped up on the screen a moment ago. It's minus six to ultimate. Separate all permanents target player controls into two piles. That player sacrifices all permanents in the pile of their choice. I will... um... (laughs) All right, looks like it's Liliana ultimate time. Cat party will now divide up Force of Phil's uh, permanents into two piles. And Phil will choose one to keep. Chat trying to figure this out as well. It looks like Chat is in agreement with uh, Cat Party's selection here. All right, Phil chooses to keep the basics in Mystic Sanctuary. Looks like Cat Party is going to waste. That's just nasty. (laughs) Terminus off the top. Okay. Draw a card to the That was a deduce discarded. It's a Dothy Void Walker. In response. Accumulated knowledge against freaking chains of Mephistopheles. <laughs> oh man. Should we just end the stream? <laughs> Crinky Doom wants us to end the stream. Uh, Lily back up to six loyalty now. Channel Takanuma. Mill three return. Yeah. All right, Takanuma getting channeled here. The channel mechanic. Oh boy, another winner. Thinking about Shouldred? Hmm. Two swords. Two terminus, two swords in the yard right now. Okay. Um, I will. I'll take Shouldred. All right, Shouldred the Apocalypse it is. Draw. I think uh, I think Cat Party's deck is a bit more mono black control. What do you say, Chad? Yep. <laughs> is it mono black aggro or is it mono black control or is it mono black mid range? I don't freaking know. Does anybody know that's watching? Help us out. Combat four, seven. Fill down to seven. It's uh, been a slow, painful, completely. Uh, okay, scooping it up. Completely one-sided nightmare game for Force of Fill. I don't know. All right, we're going to the sideboards. 
Kent Party up a game. This sanctuary pass from Phil. Yeah, I'm thinking about how I'm going to do this. Into trigger. Um, Forget it. Powerful magic. I'll charge it. Can he discard for the Alright, All right, a counterbalance to start the game for Force of Phil. Counterbalance did counter a few things in game one, right? It counted li counter Liliana, maybe one other spell. Don't be Void Walker. Reveals wear tear on top. Wear tear. It counts as three. Okay. Yeah. Used to be one or one, two, or three, but now it's just now it's just three. Okay. Um, results? Yeah. Target. Yeah, I love how at the uh, NYC locals there are, as Audrey's talking about in the chat, there are multiple mono black decks floating around. There's also a uh, Steven Rice plays kind of like a scam deck. Uh, Greg Berlinrut is playing kind of a mono black reanimator. There's just a lot going on with mono black these days. Source to plowshares on Voidwalker. Then we got Herman on a red splash. It's been awesome. All right, here's Liliana the Veil. Deduce revealed on top. It will resolve, it seems. Yeah, she's a I will have to tick up. So, double block here and then... You ping this, right? Yeah. Discarding. Okay, accumulated knowledge discarded for Force of Phil. Look like Shildred's Edict discarded by Cat Party. Liana now has four loyalty. Cat Party putting the loyalty die right over the loyalty number. Uh, I like that technique. Uh, cast the deuce. Uh, All right, Force of Phil cast the deuce, makes a clue. Ever since uh, 90s MTG, uh, uh, ever since Call of Manor came out, 90s MTG has been showcasing Call of Manor block constructed. Every freaking game now has a surveil and a clue. Who's going to crack the case? <laughs> Yeah. Seven? Mystic Sanctuary putting Deduce back on top of the library. So a two on top for counterbalance. Where's the Phil leaving that revealed? As a reminder to all of us. Very helpful. Okay, Phil discards the swords. I did not see what Cat Party discarded. This graveyard's covered up. It's cloak blue. Can you think of dinosaur? Yep. All right, cracking the clue using the floating mana, draws the deuce, and we're passing the turn. <laughs> All right, making another clue. Ooh, Volcanic Island. Kind of Yep. Dothy Voidwalker, Counterbalance Trigger, Brainstorm. Yep, don't yeah. in the car. Swing. Uh, so there's a Counterbalance Trigger on the stack. Force of Phil is going to try and uh, set the top of the deck to two. Counter this thing on the stack. That's my guess. Uh, this is still on the stack. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to cycle Lord. Okay, so maybe Force of Phil did not find a two. I'm going to cycle Lurian revealed here to change the top of the deck one more time. Ninja God King says chains versus counterbalance. What year is it? Yeah. Yeah. Wear Terror Revealed. That's a three, so Void Walker is in. Liliana the Veil getting activated. Looks like Cat Party is Hellbent. Force of Phil has to think about discarding. 
Yeah, and the card discarded will go into the void. It's a copy of Wear Tear. That's kind of interesting. Sacking Voidwalker now could blow up Counterbalance, potentially. I mean, it's available. Force of Phil cracking the Misty. It should go under the void, but that's okay. Misty, Mystic Sanctuary is found. Yeah, yeah that's just like... All right, correct it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm not saying it was wrong. It's just like that was yeah. 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 Source to plowshares putting uh, put back on top. It could be a way to remove this void walker. Yeah. Yeah. And you're just gonna get just run over. Yeah, run over by the uh, Okay, so sack into clue to draw the swords, remove the void walker, and pass the turn. Liliana on the Veil up to six loyalty currently. We saw it ultimate in game one. Chains of Mephistopheles, swords revealed on top, chains will resolve. Liliana going to plus here? Yep, discarding a Tundra. Team of Priest and Gatekeeper, a little bit of a nombo for blinking my own guys. Yeah. <laughs> um, blinking? Oh, wait, I'll play Swamp. Yeah. Because uh, my original plan when I was thinking about the tax was like, okay, then I'll blink the Soothsayer. Oh, I can't blink the Priest and Soothsayer. Good. Oh no, it's that boy, Scooter. Thank you for the sub with Prime, six months. It's one of those things you do once. Hey, yo. Wear Terror blows up Chains and Mephistopheles. Uh, it's just destroyed, but yeah. Sorry, I thought this. I thought you'd exhaust. Yeah, you could. Um, uh, Jace Pink has arrived, everybody. Show and tell on mission. Liliano, the Ultimate. Three Mystic Sanctuary sacrificed. Yeah, Chains of Mephistopheles is removed. Do you like the Surveil lands in there though? Do they disrupt your like, turn one, turn two plays or not really? Oh, not really. really. <laughs> Looks like uh, Swords of Plowshares discarded for fills. Something on Cat Party's side. Here's your Revitalize, draw, gain three life, draw a card. Where I don't necessarily want to uh, have to go for it. Uh -huh. What did you gain the one on there? Just oh, being able to play a longer game, I think. So. Uh, did I gain? It should be a 1, so. 2, 18, 21. Did I lose a life item? I think I would have taken one of the uh, one. Like, seven. Bench, bench. Uh, this is, okay, yeah, sorry. Uh, I don't know why I can do a 17. Just fine. Because, yeah, I never... I don't think I've been tagged yet. Okay. Yeah, yeah so 21. Oh, you lost? Come on. Uh, pass it over to you. Uh, is there a Hellbent? All right, Phyllis Hellbent. Liliana continues to tick up. Here's Liliana last hope. Deduce revealed the counterbalance, so Liliana will resolve. Plus nothing, plus nothing happens. Deduce. Everything is all. Uh, I will check up here uh, first. Yep. Check up here. Treat the angels discarded. Phil's digging. You have to learn the cascade technique. Yeah. You flip the deck around and you just start flipping off the top. You good? Yeah, you're good. Uh, it's your job. Go. Uh, I'll take both. Yeah. Do you get the. I get the clue. Go ahead. Um, okay. Do you have one card in yeah. One card. And. Um. Check up. Yeah. Check up. Uh, I'm gonna crack it. Phil cracking a fetch with Liliana the Veil's plus ability on this deck. Mystic Sanctuary. Looks like pointing at Entreat the Angels. Is, is Phil going to somehow win this game? Uh, I'm going to cast okay for two. Uh, accumulated knowledge now. <laughs> oh boy. 
And treat the angels on top. Ponder discarded. <laughs> Could potentially make three angels here, and he will. So three angels and a clue token. Liliana Last Hope has six loyalty right now. So does Liliana the Veil. Last Hope's ultimate is seven loyalty required. One card in Phil's hand. She's got a fat ass. What could it be? It could be anything. Um, All right, Liliana the Veil has ultimated. What? How will Cat Party divide this up? Hmm. Robert's predicting creatures and lands into two separate piles. Do you want lands or do you want non-land permanents? Your pick, Force of Phil. That's what the Twitch chat is predicting. Let's see how Cat Party picks this. I'm just gonna put these in one pile. These in one pile, these in another. Okay, leaves counterbalance with the lands. So lands and counterbalance or a clue and four angels. Or three angels. All right, Phil lets the creatures die and the clue die. Keeps the lands and the counterbalance. Four light. Yeah. Check up here. Yep. Liliana, Liliana Last Hope will take up to seven, so could ultimate next turn. Ooh, Wasteland. Got to hit white here, right? Oh, the Sanctuary. Okay, going out to Sanctuary. Put my turn. Cast. Yep. Uh, AK, draw three. <laughs> There's a brainstorm. We have been presented with some interesting situations so far in this match, that is for sure. The last hope, uh, Liliana Ultimate, is hard to beat. Uh, I've been playing Legacy long enough to remember when this card was new and it was played a lot in Legacy and I've ultimated a few times and had it ultimated against me a few times. It is really tough. Oh! I should have two cards. These are my three cards. You should have three. I should have three. Because yeah. my, my plan is very clearly. All right, we're going to need to rewind the tape and inspect all of that. The uh, DCI will be making sure that everything went okay with that. Now another accumulated knowledge on the stack. Phil draw four cards this time. I'll draw. Um, I'll all. all right, Lily on the last hope has ultimated. Does Cat Party have the emblem? <laughs> we don't mess around on this channel, folks. We do not mess around. Oh. Yep. Yep. This is just not a game. This is a lifestyle. All right, there's some zombie tokens. It's all happening. The Dexter Kennedy, thank you for the resub. Six months, love the legacy content. One day I'll jam games of it. That's a good plan. Thank you, Dexter. Uh, seven, I'll move to discard. I'm at seven, you're at 28. You're at seven. I'm sorry, I have eight. I'm going to move to discard. Go to seven. Go. All right, discarding a swords to hand size. Combat? Yep. Yeah. Two, two, two zombies are attacking. Audrey says, are the emblem and the planeswalker from the same edition, though? That's the true test of commitment. Yeah, we're going to be uh, inspecting all that. All right, so two more zombies get created here. There are four total now. I think it's obvious... 
that Force of Phil needs to hurry up. All right, here's Witness to Future. We're gonna put three Mystic Sanctuaries and something else. I didn't agree tonight. Oh yeah, you're right. There should be six zombies. That's right. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, there should there should be six zombies on the board right now, but there's only four. With four? Eight. Just eight. Eight damage comes in. It's unlikely to matter, I guess. I'm also go paranoid. If I've been so I'll uh, put my ass down. Yeah, I just didn't cast it. Just alter cast it. So you have me me too. So I was not good. Moving to end step, Force of Phil is going to cycle Lorien Revealed. Oh, Mystic Sanctuary could put Entreat back on top. Let's see how this goes. Right, four, six. Uh, one card in hand? One. Which is like kind of what I did. Um, um, X is two plus number, so I control four. So you make six. I make okay. another four, six. So I'll have ten. ten. Yeah. Four. Should you have made four last turn? Yeah. Yeah. It was two plus, plus what you have, right? Is that what yeah. this is? So I had two. Yeah. Where X is put two X plus. Is, oh, does it go where two X is six? two plus, so you should have been six last turn. Yeah, exactly. So you attack for four, so I should be down another four. What if I just play okay. one? Right? All right, they're, connect they're correcting it now. What uh, Twitch chat pointed out was correct. So now there are going to be the correct amount of zombies on the battlefield. Right. Eight plus another two. Turn okay. one more. Well, you have six here. So you should get yeah. six plus two, which is eight. Right, so 14. So you should have 14 total. Yes. Thank you. All right, so Cat Party will now have 14 total uh, zombies on the battlefield. They wouldn't all be tapped, but I, I think we're just kind of shortcutting a bit here, maybe. All right, so a terminus happens. Entreat the Angels is back on top. Can Phil win this? Phyrexian Crusader. Oh, Counterbalance has a three on top already. All right, we're, good. we're doing a take back. Um, you're not running shock, are you? <laughs> Uh, no, in a format where you can play any, uh, any, red, any red burn spell, shot. All right, Phil's making four angels here. Treat the angels is uh, happening. Mystic Sanctuary is going to put and treat back on top of the library. Wow, there's like some other. Uh, uh, masters? Uh, what's, what's in your group? Yeah, which I think is. Yeah, I don't know. Huh. Harry Houdini just gifted a sub. Thank you, Harry. Cat Party's in the chat. This was my first time ever ultimating Liliana and Baffled by the Math. Oh, it's all good. Don't worry about it. We haven't seen this card ultimated on 90s MGG in a really, really long time. That's for sure. I don't even think we've seen Lily Last Hope in, in like years on this channel. So this is all exciting. <laughs> Force of Phil facing down a Bowmaster at three life, plus two zombies, plus a Liliana emblem, and attacks are coming in. Looks like Phil's blocking two zombies and a Bowmaster. Treat the Angels is on top of the deck. This is this is wild. Okay, here's Shouldered, which could be a problem with Phil at two life. Is this a game-winning Shouldered, folks? There is a counterbalance trigger. I don't believe Phil, Phil has any fours in the graveyard. I'm at one. Voodoo says, don't worry, Legacy is full of mistakes. That's the best part. Yeah, I think that's a great way to describe everything that's going on with... Uh, with Magic the Gathering and Legacy. 
Just a whole bunch of mistakes. There is a thwart in the deck. That's a four. But it's not in the graveyard. All right, Phil searches up a basic island. What does that mean? All right, cut me to a miracle. <laughs> All right, Phil says cut me to a miracle. Lorian revealed, revealed, and that is the match. Cat Party gets it.